We have 10 nl, 20 nl, and 25 nl. This light is called calibration mark, and pipette actually is used to transfer a specific volume of liquid from one container to another. Then this is pipette bar. Pipette bar actually is used to suck the the solution into the pipette when you put it on the top of the pipette. This is the solution that we use for demonstration. Hi, I'm Minwei. Hi, I'm Anika. Today, we will demonstrate about how to use pipette. First, we need to press the pipette valve to remove the air inside of the pipette valve. After that, we use the pipette valve place on top of the pipette and not to insert it. The proper way is to place it is to place it, remember? Now, we will place the pipette inside the solution. After that, we put the pipette bulb on the top of the pipette. And then, we slowly suck the solution into the pipette. If the water level is rise above the calibration mark, we will spin the pipette slowly till the water level drop to the calibration mark. To let the water flow out from the pipette, we need to remove our tongue. Now, we will transfer the solution to container we want. So we fill the pipette about half the volume and then we let it slide along the pipette so that it, it touch through the inner wall 
and then we drain it. Repeat this step for three times. We cannot pipette the solution directly from the flask of the solution as this can contaminate the solution inside the flask. So what we can do is we pour the solution in a appropriate beaker like this. Then we can start to pipette it. We need to make sure the tip of the pipette is below the water level so that we did not suck up the air inside the pipette. If we suck the air inside the pipette, we need to redo it again. That's all from me.